didn't even know you were good at making malts. Good? I'm an expert. Didn't I tell you I used to work in a malt shop when I was in high school? Soda jerk? No, thanks. I'll have a malt. <laughs> Aren't you going to have one, Doc? Oh, no. Listen, after you've worked in a malt shop, the greatest pleasure you can get is slurping up what's left in the blender. <laughs> mm. Um. Is it any wonder I never breastfed her? Uh, what are you doing out? I thought you were in your room. I whittled a gun out of a bar of soap and overpowered the guards. <laughs> I went to the mini mall. They opened a little slice of Sicily pizzeria. So I walk in and this guy strikes up a conversation with me. Turns out he owns the chain and wants me to be in a commercial. Sophia, that's amazing! I'll say it's rare you find anybody in a mini mall who even speaks English. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, Ma, where are you going to shoot this commercial? Well, we discussed many exotic uh, locations, and we settled on right here. Oh, now, hold on here. I don't want a TV crew coming in here, messing up my kitchen, setting up all that video equipment. Well, how about shooting in your bedroom, Blanche? The equipment's already set up there. <laughs> Blanche, I don't think you're going to have to worry. It's not going to happen. Has anybody seen a small bottle of pills? Brown bottle, Patton's Pharmacy label, your name on the prescription? Yeah. Never saw it. <laughs> Ma. All right. Yesterday, I was looking for the oregano and accidentally knocked them into the sink. I forgot all about it. Well, that's great. Now I won't be able to refill the prescription till tomorrow. Tomorrow's a holiday. Pharmacy's closed. Maybe I have another bottle in my room. I can't understand how you could forget to tell Rose about that accident. Forgive me, my memory's not as good as it used to be. Nothing on me is as good as it used to be. <laughs> Once upon a time, I had a butt you could bounce a quarter on. <laughs> now you could lose a Krugerrand in the creases. <laughs> Hello. Oh, I'm sorry. I hope I'm not interrupting anything. Uh, Dorothy, meet my director, Cy Ferber. Cy, uh, my daughter, Dorothy. Daughter? You're kidding. Cy, I assure you, I won't be flattered if you say you thought she was my sister. <laughs> no, no. I just had an idea. Little Slice of Sicily's a family restaurant, and a mother-daughter commercial would be great. How'd you like to be in it? I, I don't know. I mean, I'd have to check my schedule. You see, I'm a substitute teacher. Please, so someone else sets up the driver's ed cones. <laughs> All right, Ma. Actually, Si, I'd be delighted to do it. Beautiful. Guess what? I'm going to be in that commercial with Ma. Dorothy, I told you I don't want a bunch of strangers traipsing through my kitchen. We'll pay you $1,000 a day. Allow me to give you the grand tour. <laughs> in here to everyone out. What's wrong, Rose? The slightest noise on my hoop of cake will fall. <laughs> oh, why, why, why? Rose? Honey, calm down. You can make another cake. Look, we're going to set it up over here. Uh, Dorothy, I'm going to put you right here. Sophia, I want you by Excuse the table. Excuse me, I'm going to have to ask you to leave. I'm very upset. Rose? <laughs> This man is paying me $1,000 a day to make a commercial in my kitchen. I live here, too. I have every right to use this kitchen. Miss, this will only take a second. Oh, yeah, well, it'll only take a second to knock you on your keister, buddy. Now, what's it going to be? Look, if I wanted this kind of abuse, I'd be directing the Roseanne Barr show. <laughs> oh, but, Si... Look, the commercial is off. Just forget it. Well... Rose, now look what you did. I didn't do anything wrong. Rose, why are you acting like this? I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Just get off my damn back. 